Your health and safety, it's a reason we go out every single week to get you answers about the places where you love to eat. It's the weekend, so in this week's original restaurant report, Action News Jack's Ben Becker shows us violations that inspectors found at some of our local restaurants. Sesame, ranch, and garlic. They are some of the flavored crusts available at Hungry Howie's. But inspectors discovered more than the smell of onions at one location. <laughs> I paid a visit to the Hungry Howie's, Southside Boulevard, near Anders. You passed the follow-up. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Inspectors say they originally found an objectionable odor in the establishment, potentially hazardous food temperatures, and an employee with an ineffective hair restraint. Do you know what the odor was? It was from the sinks. So what we do is we put bleach down them every night, and the odor is gone. It happens at every restaurant. Every restaurant? I reached out to the state, and I was told bleach is allowed to be used as a cleaner in a sink. Elsewhere, the Bent Creek Golf Club was cited for food with mold-like growth, potentially hazardous food temperatures, and the floor soiled with accumulated debris. Inspectors say the Bonos on US-1 near Lewis Point Road in St. Augustine had live small flying insects in the kitchen. No proof of required employee training, and the hand wash sink was not accessible for employee use. Our final stop, the Carabas on State Road 312 near US-1 was cited for potentially hazardous food temperatures. Cold holding equipment not maintained in good repair, and the slicer blade soiled with food debris. In the studio, Ben Becker, CBS 47, Fox 30, Action News Jax.